Hey everyone, I'm Laurencio, and in this video, I'm going to talk about all Aoi Sora games for the Sony PSP. Aoi Sora no Neosphere, Nanoka Flanka no Hatsume Kabuki are games with too much story. And if you followed my reviews, you know that usually the story is the main attraction for me in a game. But here, it just gets in the way. You go outside to sell some cheese, boom, 50 minutes of cutscene. You want to brew some alchemy stuff, someone comes at your door and doesn't stop talking. But when you get away from the story, you need to gather recipes, you're an alchemist. So you get to research milk, learn to make cheese, research a virus, learn to make a vaccine, research stone, learn to make cement, research that cement and you learn to make concrete. You develop the country by having Nanoka sell this to the town people. And you progress in the story by having her fulfill the two or three special requests people give her every month. And the game drags for too long. I didn't like the game. For me it was boring and with way too much story in the way of the gameplay. But if what I've said sounds interesting to you, you should try the game out. I mean, it's it's very popular, at least in Japan, by my internet searches, it seems that the game is popular. And about the story, if I mention it. You play as Nanoka Flanka and have to rebuild the town by building gadgets and doing alchemical research. You improve the way of life and the cities you are in with your inventions that you sell to the town people. Also, in case you play the game and like it, just know that they released a DLC. They released Aomi Umi no Tristia 10th Anniversary Memorial Pack in 2012. 